Good morning from the Flying J parking lot in El Paso. I uh, been up a little bit, freshened up a little bit. I had some problems with my editing software last night, so I just went to sleep. Slept okay, it's the first time I ever boondocked, and it was pretty good. They have full on restrooms in the Flying J. They have showers and everything, so it's nice to freshen up. And so now I'm gonna get some, uh, I'm gonna get some fuel. Need to refill while I'm here. Might as well, I'm at half a tank, but it's a good idea. Yes. Thank you. Love your hair, by the way. Oh, thank you so thank much. You. Thank oh, you. Have a safe morning. Thanks you as well. Yes. Starbucks. All right. Now to get out of here and get back on the freeway. Something that is super cool about each of the rest stops is how they personalize it for the county and the state that you're in. So now I'm in Texas and everything's all about Texas. There's a bee or something following me. It has like been behind me ever since I got out of the car. Oh my God. Ah. Okay, bee's finally gone. I need to use the restroom and then I want to look around. Oh, stretch my legs. Looking at this area of the world, you can see how before the flood, you know, Texas was smaller and it got pulled apart when Pangea started to get pulled apart. And so this whole area, you'll see tons of fossils and deposits of oil. And so that's why, of course, you see all the oil drills and stuff in Texas. And lots of lots of seashells out here in the desert. So some of you may have picked up by now that I live in San Diego. San Diego is my home base, but I was born and raised in Texas. So it feels really odd coming back here. Um, I didn't grow up in this area. It was, I grew up in near Houston, um, north of Houston. Um, we called it the backwoods because it was just out in the sticks. Though I've heard it's a lot, um, it's a lot more developed now. But you know. I have no problems with the fact that the state flag 
is raised the same height as the US flag because I understand the history. That's why it has approval for it. And I'm just following a little trail they have around the, the rest stop. Get my legs stretching while I'm telling you guys this because it's easier to tell you this while I'm walking around than it is while I'm driving. Because uh, it's, <laughs> you can go 80 miles an hour. <laughs> Some places it's 75. And the other places it's 80, which is about the temperature right now and I'm wearing a sweater. Anyway, so I'm going back to visit family. I'm going back to visit some friends and some I haven't seen since middle school. And it's, it's surreal being back. I moved out of state in 99 and I've been living in Southern California um, ever since, minus a few years in Japan. It's really strange to go, you know, back home. Um, I still think of myself half and half, half Texan, half San Diegan, and it's, you know, born and raised with a lot of appreciation for the for the sacrifices made for the state, Texas. But home base, that's where all the people are that are part of my tribe, you know, that's San Diego. And I gotta say, there are some days that it's hot, but it's not nearly as hot in San Diego as it is half the year in Texas. Todd and Tamaris and we had a wonderful evening just sitting back talking about travel and all the fun things that we've been just enjoying over the last couple weeks and then I started editing the footage from yesterday and so unfortunately it looks like that hard drive that I had put all that footage onto corrupted. So I'm going to see if I can do battle with it again tomorrow. I was doing research on that brand of hard drive and the website was saying that every time 
the when a hard drive beeps like that that it means that it's not getting enough power or that the hard drive has been corrupted so it looks like all the footage from the first half of the journey getting here which was from san diego to el paso is gone it's all gone all the footage i've ever taken in the time that i've been traveling it's all gone so i have no backups from what is on youtube the only backups there are is what's there i don't even have the original footage um, before it was put into the format necessary and all the editing so i'm gonna try again tomorrow if that does not work then i'm just gonna be uploading today's drive footage and you won't know it's missing because you'll just see today's <laughs> so i'm gonna go wash my face brush my teeth and i'll see y'all tomorrow